I think most teams start with the same goals, ultimately get down to St. Paul at the end of the season. We have a stacked section, um, so I mean, I, I think it's one of the deepest ones in the state. But, you know, ultimately it's just for the girls to come together um, and be able to say that at the end of the season they had no regrets. They just left everything on the ice and they gave it everything they had. I think that this season we're going to succeed because we're going to lean off of each other and learn from each other and we're going to grow from that and have a great team environment. The personality of our team is like honest, a very uplifting environment. It's a very, it's full of girls who are willing to learn from each other and to help each other to succeed more. We're all like really good friends and teammates and we all like work very hard together. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be a good mix of some senior leadership uh, with some youth um, and I think when it all comes together it's going to be fun to watch. Watch us this year, you know, see how far we make it. <laughs> Let's go CPCR. <laughs>
Yeah, I was just going to say too, like not only there's hard working on the ice, but it's also the type of person you are off the ice that we want to be known for here. I feel like Andover Hockey, we've always done it the right way, you know, we're respectful, you know, we appreciate everybody we're playing against and the referees. And I feel like we just, we have a big motto here is like everything, what you do affects everybody in the high school and it's not just one person, it's the whole team, you know, when something goes wrong. So we like to keep it professional and respectful. Girls hockey action at Anoka. It's the Tornadoes taking on the Northern Tier Stars in the first period. Annika Olsen making a big save, setting the tone early. Abby Thurmer for the Northern Tier Stars does the same. It was a back and forth first period, but no goals. Here was the closest chance. Georgia Franzwa had a wide open net and hit it off the side of the cage. Here was another opportunity for the Northern Tier Stars. They had three opportunities from close range, could not put it in the net. We get out of the first period scoreless in the second period. Goalie is making big saves here early. Here's another opportunity. That one whistled early, but it was Lucy Machula starting the scoring. That one whistled high over Thurmer. Gives the Tornadoes a 1-0 lead later. Just two minutes later, Leah Amsler, her third of the season, gives the Tornadoes a 2-0 lead. Could have gotten more, but it was missing the net. And then late in the period, Chloe King on the power play with a beauty move. Cuts the deficit to one. Then in the third, Tornado's looking to add on, trying to create something. Instead, it's the Stars. Loose puck in the crease, back and forth. It finally goes in. They get credited to Ariel Carlson. We're tied. Then later, wide open net for Taylor Kozak off of the shot from Brooklyn Carlson. Northern Tier Stars, they win their third game of the season by a score of three to two.